All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Buccaneers Daily. My name is Jackson. I post daily Bucks content. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button as we try and push for 3,000 subscribers. Beautiful night here in Southwest Florida. Now, we have the official injury report ready for week six game against the Pittsburgh Steelers. Now, keep this in mind, guys. You know, I'm not too happy, I guess, technically with the injury report. However, it's getting on the right track. Akeem Hicks, Sean Murphy Button, Logan Ryan, and most likely Julio Jones looking doubtful, so most likely no Julio Jones. Mike Edwards is also questionable. The good news is, first off, it's week six, right? And they're starting to get their bodies back. I know it's not necessarily ideal, however, it is Pittsburgh, so you would have to wonder, you know, had this be you know, the first week of the playoffs, I bet a lot of those guys are suiting up. Especially with guys like Akeem Hicks and Julio Jones, just get healthy. You know, just get healthy. Trust me, you know, I'm missing Sue. You know, I, I, <laughs> Akeem Hicks is a dog, though. Once Akeem Hicks is healthy and he's back on the field at a consistent level, you'll see the production come through. Same thing applies to Julio Jones. This is something we were talking about right when he got signed was, man, if he ever gets injured, just let him sit. You know, just let him sit. Keep him in when he's healthy. Keep him in third downs red zone situations and he's made some nice plays he's made some nice catches in his brief tenure so far with tampa bay i think this is more of a move down the line right the good news is chris godwin suiting up rashad perriman suiting up russell gage is suiting up so they mike evans suiting up so they have plenty of receiving they have plenty cameron braids coming back they have plenty of threats on the offensive end, obviously, for a net. So I'm not worried about Pittsburgh. You know, I'm not worried about t- Pittsburgh. Obviously, it's the NFL, and you don't want to take any game for granted. However, I feel pretty good. You know, they're going through some quarterback issues. They're going through some team issues. They're 1-4 and four right now. Their one win was a, it was actually a pretty impressive win against the Cincinnati Bengals in the first week. However, they're coming off a 38-3 to loss to the Buffalo Bills. I'll do a game preview tomorrow. So once again, hit that sub button if you guys enjoy it and you like Daily Bucks content. But that's the injury report. You know, that's the injury report right now. All I'm focused on is this. I want that offense to keep clicking. And right now, you're playing a struggling Pittsburgh Steelers defense. Tom Brady, back-to-back 350-yard games. I got a comment the other day saying, Jameis Winston threw for 350 yards. Like, Tom Brady doing that means nothing. We're really comparing Jameis Winston to Tom Brady. Come on now, let's figure it out. So I anticipate, you know, honestly, last week I anticipated a much bigger win than 21-16 to uh, <laughs> narrow win. But a win is a win, right? A win is a win on the win column. So, hey. I'll take a win this week against Pittsburgh. Let me know what you guys are thinking. Stay tuned for that game preview tomorrow. I'll catch you guys later.